People of the Purple Butterfly here, otherwise known as People of Seven on Twitter and YouTube, People of Elsewhere on the Internet. My blog is located at purplebutterfly-people.blogspot.com, and my soaps, Purple Butterfly Soaps, can be located at people.etsu.com. <coughs> Excuse me. And I was going to use a method I saw in a video to trim my bangs. And then it occurred to me, I do tend to get a little bit cut happy, which means if I trim my bangs, something's not going to look right, and then I'll look up and all the hair be gone. I'm one of them people where if you go to paint one room, you know, in the living room, then all of a sudden the dining room don't look right. So then you paint the dining room and the kitchen don't look right. So you end up, I mean, that's just my reality. And I'm like, well, am I supposed to go from here to here or whatever? So I've decided instead of, you know, pulling down my veins and then trimming them and letting it spring back to, you know, it was a method that was on the video, and I'm going, oh, that's a good idea. That way it doesn't get too short or whatever. I'm just going to redo the way I style my hair. So... I'm either going to get used to it being in my face or I'm going to keep it off my face. But if you know your scissor happy and you see a video like that and her hairstyle looked great and the method she used was amazing, but at the end of the day, I have to look at the person I am, and I know I have one of those obsessive, compulsive, you know, I have been diagnosed with ADD and OCD, so I know me well enough to know that click here, click there, click there, leave the rest alone. <laughs> that won't work for me because I've been to click here, click here, click here, click here, click here. Hey, where all the hair go? And I've already been accused of cutting my hair in sneaky bits, so. <laughs> yeah. In the meantime, for the first time since the stroke, I woke up pain-free this morning. I mean, look. Nothing hurts to move. Now, about 2 o'clock, the spasticity in my leg and my arm came back, but no pain, no spasms, no none of that. And now it's 10.35. I'm still pain-free. Um, the walking, I mean, my foot still drops when I walk, and I still need the cane to support because, you know, it still goes out, and I still get that jerky thing with my hand, but there's no pain. I am celebrating a pain-free day. Yay! I don't know why or how long it's going to last, but I know one thing. Today was a good day. It had some issues that came back, but it was a good day. That means I'm capable of having more good days. So I'm going to celebrate those good days because usually I wake up in a little pain or a lot of pain. Nothing in the last five months has been, I woke up in no pain. This is the first day that's happened since the stroke. So I'm looking for... The next day it happens, and hopefully the good day will be a good week, a good month, a good year, so forth and so on. So I will take the single pain-free day, even though, you know, some of the issues came back as a good thing, because that means there can be another one and another one and another one. Now, by now... I'm getting a little tired, and I can feel a little tightness in my back, you know, mainly because, you know, you wake up with no pain, and you end up doing a bunch of stuff that, you know, you haven't been able to do for a while, plus you do some stuff that you probably shouldn't do. Like a song came on the radio and says nothing hurt. I was like, hey. 
probably pulled a muscle or something. But still, you know, it's been a good day. So, in the meantime, I washed my hair. I took a whole shower, mainly because, I mean, I was in no pain. And the water didn't feel like needles hitting me. I need more days like today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the meantime, this has been People of Seven on Twitter, YouTube, People of Elsewhere on the Internet. My blog is located at purplebutterfly peoplablogspotcom and my soaps, Purple Butterfly Soaps, can be located at peoplablogspotcom And I have to retract a certain statement. There is a little pain right here. I've been smiling so much that my jaw is starting to hurt. But other than that, hey, y'all stay blessed.